Hey guys, what's going on? Brendan Milley here, back with another video, and today is another challenge video. I really like these challenge videos because they allow me to get really creative and to really try something new and unique. So recently, I was kind of challenged by one of my friends who has a YouTube channel, Zachary Fisher. His YouTube channel is Make or Break, link in the description. He does some awesome videos and we were talking the other night and he's like, you know what, you should try to make a fishing rod out of PVC pipe. Now me and PVC pipe have a very good relationship. When I was a kid, I used to build all kinds of things out of PVC pipe, bow and arrows, catapults, all kinds of crazy stuff. So I'm going to try to get back to my roots. We're going to try and build a fishing pole out of PVC pipe and then we're going to take it out and see if it works to catch some fish. This should be a lot of fun. Let's go. So for this build, I'm going to be using PVC pipe and electrical tape. Now, I could use PVC glue, but I want to try and keep this as minimalistic and as simple as I can. Plus, I don't want to ruin all this PVC pipe because it's not mine. It's actually my dad's. Now, every good rod has a good taper. And what does that mean? Well, it means that the rod usually starts off pretty stiff, and then as you get towards the tip, it becomes more and more limber. This is going to be very challenging with PVC pipe because as you can see, I have this piece right here. It's very, very flexible, so I have to be able to taper it. So what I'm thinking of doing is using three different sizes of PVC pipe. I can use this piece right here. It's really thick for the handle, and then I can go up to a thicker piece that's not as flexible, and then I'll finally finish out the tip with this really, really floppy stuff. All right, so this is actually going to be pretty simple. I got my handle piece right here, and then this piece, they actually just fit together really nicely like this. There we go. Now I'll just take my tape and just wrap it around there. Just going to wrap it around nice and tight. So as you can see, there's the start of our rod. As you can see, it's got a pretty good flex to it already. I'll tell you one thing though, this is a really, really big handle. It's going to be very interesting to try and fish with this. So we got that on. Let's put the next piece on. So we got the last piece here put him in. Well, that's going to be pretty decent. I think that'll work good. Uh, like I said, guys, this is a really, really simple build. I mean, you could do this at home if you wanted to. I don't know why you would want to try and make a PVC fishing pole, but if you want to, it's very, very simple. All right, guys, this is our finished fishing pole. And let me just say the action of this thing is not the best. It is very, very floppy. As you can see, it does have sort of a, a bend to it like a normal fishing pole but let me tell you something this thing is extremely heavy so you know when you're trying to cast this it's going to be very very floppy and very very difficult but that is part of the challenge i'm going to throw a reel on this thing and some line guides and we're taking it fishing so for the eyes i just took a piece of wire and bent it like this Here, I apologize for the audio quality. My microphone just died, so we'll have to use the GoPro audio and the audio on the top of the camera. But nevertheless, let's get into trying to catch a fish with this weird contraption. I'm going to start off here with a little crankbait, a little minnow crankbait. I believe this is a scatter wrap minnow in like a chartreuse blue color. Water's pretty clear. We should be able to get these fish to bite. I just don't know how this rod's going to handle. Uh, a fish on it. We'll have to see once. First cast. Okay, wow, that's definitely different. Very heavy. Very heavy. It's like trying to cast a two by four. Like weeds. It's very difficult to cast. There on there, but I don't know if I can without getting wet. There we go. Okay. 
<laughs> Let's just say the accuracy when fishing with this thing is not gonna be the highest priority. This is not very good at casting. Oh, it's in the weeds. I got a fish, no way. I got a bass, no way. Oh my goodness, cripe sakes. Oh my, it's a good one too. Look at this thing. What the world? Yeah, yes. I got one on this ridiculous rod. Oh my goodness. Look at that thing. What? I did, I cast it right up there shallow. I thought I had a weed. That was a bass. Okay. Wow, look at that guy, guys. Nice fish, too, all silvery. That is ridiculous. I just caught a fish on a PVC rod. That is amazing, right there, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get the release. See here, guys, look what I just found. You see this drone? This used to be my drone, believe it or not. Uh, I was out filming my MTB slam for the month of March, early this year, and my brother was flying this thing over the water and crashed it into the pond. As you can see, it's waterlogged. We finally found it uh, later one day as we were swimming in the pond. There it is. 300 bucks down the drain. <sighs> Sorry. So guys, there you have it. You can indeed catch fish with a PVC fishing rod. Special thanks to Zachary Fisher for giving me this idea. Be sure to check out his channel again. Like I said, links are in the description or up in the cards. He does some fantastic work. Be sure to subscribe for more videos like this. So guys, thanks for watching and I will catch you next time.